Okay, I was just gonna say I have a question about the character. So, like, you're playing as Alexios. Um, yeah. So, we, because from every, every all the promotional stuff I've seen and all of the trailers and gameplay, it doesn't. To me, the character doesn't feel like a. Like, even, it doesn't even feel like some of the worst Assassin's Creed characters where it's, like, an established character you're playing as. It feels like this empty shell for the player. It's, just, it's like a vessel for the player more than anything. But does it feel like that when you're playing it, or does it feel like this is a character that's written and there's a story and this person clearly has a personality, like, compared yeah, to the I other feel games? Like, yeah, yeah, I feel like, from what I saw, um, there is some level of, like, personality and character there. Like, there is a level of, like... Because the backstory of this character is given to you. And I fe- I felt like, from what I saw of that, and the way I can, I could pretty easily see where that character goes and pick mm. the right options dialogue-wise and certain things to kind of, like, give me... The, well, this is kind of what this character seems like it would do. And, uh, well, you know, in, in some ways, do you want to tell your own story here? Um, you know, do they develop as a character so will they start off a bit i don't know because he was he's a disgrace spartan is he closed off at the start and then later on you're a bit more open with things going i don't know like do, i don't know how the story goes but mm-hmm. um yeah, there's a cat i feel like there's a character there or there's enough information that's established that you can have a character you can see him as a character and then play from there if that makes sense okay sure yeah, there's. I definitely feel there's definitely enough information that it's an established character for Alexios, and that's, I assume it's the same as Cassandra. I mean, I've. It's just from everything they've shown to me, it's always felt like it's just this empty nothing. Like I've never felt this sense of character. Whereas with Bayek, I felt like there was this story there that they were trying to outline. But I feel like with oh, the, yeah. well, there's no this is there's, there's no Bayek or anything. Well, no, like, I, like no, this, of course, yeah. Bayek's yeah. special, but it was. You know, there was this, there was, with the marketing for Origins, there was this clear indication of this is Bayek and this is his story, whereas with Odyssey, I feel like they've got, they've gone so far down that this is your story that they're not even trying to show the story of the game. They're just like, this is just your story. Just fucking play as either of these, do what the fuck you want. Like, that's the way it comes across. So I guess, yeah, I suppose you have to wait to play the game to really appreciate if they're t- trying to tell a story of this character or whatever. Um... But, I mean, I suppose that's good. I mean, when I play, I'll play as Cassandra, just because she's canon, and it'll bug me playing as Alexios, but, you know. Oh, yeah. yeah I also, think I'm not sexist, voice so... Yeah, well, I am, so I'm going to play as Alexios. <laughs> 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 uh, fuck, that's funny. Um, um, if I Just for now, like, obviously I can't answer every question, but, like, if anyone in the chat has questions about mm-hmm. Odyssey... I, now might be a good time to ask him and I can answer yeah. some stuff if anyone's got any any pressing questions. Obviously, I can't talk about anything to do with um, whether I played Saw or anything to do with present day or other some story stuff I can't like talk about. But, okay. you know, I, nothing is that major. Like, as well, like, just because I can't talk about them doesn't mean they're that well. Dude, this is top secret. It's fucking yeah, amazing. Yeah. It's not like, it, like it's like with origins. Not, no one could talk about modern like, day, but it's not good. Yeah, yeah I, I just can't talk about it. Like yeah, it's not. Yeah. Like so, um, but it's not that I'm not saying it's not, but I'm not saying it is either. So don't just don't take it as oh my god, I, this must be amazing. Because someone messaged me goes, can you tell me all the story stuff you couldn't say? Someone tweeted this to me, <laughs> and I go no. And they said why not? I said because I'm not allowed to. Like, <laughs> yeah. That's great. Big question, was it good? Depends what you want from it. If you're a hardcore Assassin's Creed nerd, you're going to be pissed off underneath enjoying a fun open world RPG. Like, Does it's Alexios like, I feel like... Shoes? What's that? Does Alexios have big <laughs> shoes? Um, your thoughts on the voice acting? I mean, the site is mostly, you're fine. Like, it's not Bayek. It's not Origins, but it's not... I don't think it's that bad. I really don't... Th- I think... I also think this... What I played looks better than some of those past demos suggested as well. Mm-hmm. Like, some of those past demos made it, it, I think, look worse. And I think there's things that fixed up. Similar to the, with Origins. Remember that first demo? There were some things we didn't like about it, but they fixed up some of the combat flow and mm, true. things like that. So Something that still uh, annoyed me actually playing... I saw, like, sharks and shit, and the sharks are about 7,000 feet tall. Like this, so every animal is enormous. 
that pissed me off. That actually. Yeah, pissed me off. yeah, I've noticed I've, that. That's dumb as fuck. Yeah, the sharks are like. Well, yeah, do you know why that is? Because the animus can't read the DNA, and so it's like, oh, let's make an epic version of Greece instead. Not a, not a real oh, one. I've noticed epic. that with a lot of it. Is like that everything's more grand, and it's on this scale, and it's they've done it with the animals as well. It's because they're like, this is basically like ancient, like a fantasy ancient Greece. Like, like if we were diving into ancient Greek mythology, as opposed to like an origins where it's historically accurate. And their reason for that is, oh, the, D- the DNA doesn't work, so the animus just sort of. It just did it. It just made it up. Yeah. So, yeah I also, I, sure. I also have like a. When I say like I don't see the link between Assassin's Creed or anything like, with the universe, I think I see where they're trying to go with this. It's, where do you think they're not, trying to go? I can't. I can't say because. Just say not based on what you've played. Just say just based on absolutely well, nothing. Well, based on footage you can see that people have uploaded okay. i think and i might be totally wrong here because i haven't said this anyway i didn't even say this to the ubisoft people i said i think i have an idea i feel like because at the start they this little girl her name's phoebe she's on this island all the time and she like wants an eagle and um she's like an orphan so she kind of hangs around you and stuff um and you go oh she says it was you know the fact that Alexis is an eagle, like a blessing from the gods or something, and like he's yeah. super special, like he has some bloodline of gods or something like that. Right. Like that got so put up in a side right. mission. Like it's so I I'm like, are they trying to establish like these characters as like their f- actual first civ sort of like actual mm- first civ? Well, not actual. I mean, like the cl- like super strong. Well, they are though. Like that's so like, that's part of the marketing, though, isn't it? That they're like you the you, the guy you're playing as is. Whether you play as Alexios or Cassandra, like there, they have a high concentration of first Civ DNA. That's why they. Wield but it's not the like, like you fear. know, Desmond has high concentration. Yeah, but it's higher than that. I'm talking about like super, like you're like 25 percent Isu sort of shit. You mean like, like so a lot more than like even a sage, like. Yeah, like that's what I'm saying. Like more than a sage because it's so far back. That makes sense. I feel like that could that's, be something I, they do. I don't know that. I just think that from oh, what I think... those couple clues i think if that's true you know the story i know i do so I and so i'm saying if <laughs> i think if they're going to do that they won't even delve into it though i think if that's a thing that'll just be a thing and they'll never say it and it'll just be like yeah they just have a high concentration for first, first of dna just don't worry about it like we're just going to tell this other story that's really shit <laughs> and stupid. yeah well, so dante asked what annoyed you the most about it the combat some of the combat stuff pissed me off a bit um, um the naval was really difficult like you just got wrecked and everyone's after you origins does it play exactly the same uh a little extra things in it and like the customization controls are the but, same uh like no you push left stick to move oh yeah that's the same and then I there's like that. a travel speed which is nice again thank god okay you just hit square and you go straight to travel speed and then you don't have to worry about it um okay. so that's that's fine so traveling's all right with travel speed that fixes that annoying uh, issue okay right yeah but but yeah it's the same in like close quarters in combat yeah, and stuff. Yeah, because I, I hated the way it controlled like a fucking gondola or something, but it was like massive. Yeah. It was like a massive ship. It was horrible because there was no steering wheel. It just sort of like it was like a rowboat. So it was weird. Yeah, uh, Mitch Walker said, "Was the story good?" From what I played, uh, I mean, like I could again as a ancient. This what I played wasn't much. As, it was no zero Assassin's Creed stuff. It was Alexius, the Greek mercenary, just great Spartan. His storyline. I thought it was interesting. There's a couple of scenes I was like, wow, I'm interested. I actually, I can see a motivation here to the backstory. I want to keep playing and I want to complete this task and objective. Right. Is this though, looking at it from let's try and look at this balanced or is that like, if you were just to well, pick up just, the game and play it. This is what I've got like, to deal with right now. Cause right. I feel like if well, I would like, cause, because when you compare it with like these really great, interesting stories, where is it? Like, is it in the same vein as something like, you know, like even Origins? Like, I don't know. Oh, yeah. I mean, maybe it's in the same vein, probably. Yeah, probably in the same vein of like, it's its own story. Do you it's think... Own, it's self-contained. Do you think this game will fall into the good or bad Assassin's Creed Oh, games? yeah, that's an interesting question. And I thought about this. Right now, it could be the first game that's halfway. Sure. It's It's... 
It's it's either going to be the worst game of the best games, or it's going to be the best game of the worst games. That's where okay. I'm sitting at right now. That makes sense. I reckon more more likely for me it'll be the best of the worst. Uh, yeah, like that's that's where I'm sitting at with this right now. Like it's I don't know enough yet. Again, I played six hours. Yeah. There's some things I like about it. There's some things I don't like about it. It's not. I I I think I can safely say it's not going to be an Origins level. It's certainly not going to be Ezio Trilogy level, but could it be one of the good games? It definitely could be one of the good Assassin's Creed games. It definitely could be the best of the worst games. I don't see it being like a bad yeah. like three or rogue or something like that. Yeah, but that's it, it, in because terms it, of game quality, because, right? So exactly, that's because it's like it's got so much from Origins that it's yeah. going to be fun when it comes down to it yeah so in terms of being a video game but then when you look at it as obviously being assassin's an assassin's creed, creed game it's off. like yeah, yeah it's a fucking travesty but so, that's not even from me playing it i'm saying that that's from me before ever playing it and yeah. i maintain that after playing it yeah because you can't um, say because i didn't see enough yeah i oh, I, I don't even know i haven't played any of the not. stuff that suggested assassin's creedness you know what i mean like yeah i barely touched i barely yeah. scratched the surface of the storyline barely scratched the surface yeah, well, so, I mean, from what I know, nothing really happens until the end. Yeah, that's what I expect as well. Where they that's sort of do well. a do a little. No, don't you don't talk. They do a little this. thing, Just... and and, every, and then yeah. it's like, oh, that was shit. It was. Okay. Oh, I can't wait for everyone to play. It's so dumb. Yeah. Um, it's so dumb. It's like, like, honestly, it's like a syndicate dude, where it's like a stop, where it's like a parody talking. of it's. <laughs> Get it. Stop talking. So Stop. Bad. Stop ruining things for people that are going to play it anyway. Odyssey. I don't care. Fuck everyone. Yeah. Okay. Like, You're a selfish cut then. Oh, anyway. Shit. Ethan Kerr said, is Alexis better than Jacob? Uh, probably, but I don't know enough yet. Jacob, how, what was, how was the spear like? I, I mean, you, the spear two-handed was kind of annoying to use, but if you mean like the spear of Leonidas, it's whatever. It's literally nothing. It's just this thing you dual wield and it annoys you because you can't have a shield. Did you get to turn invisible? And... Oh, no. That's like high level skill, I'm pretty sure. And God I wouldn't damn. do that anyway. I'll tell you what I'm going to do is I'm going to summon in Evie Fry and then turn invisible with her and go into battle or something. It'll be epic. Um, really excited for yeah. Odyssey. Yeah. Did you experience or try out the romance options in your time playing? No, I didn't have to go to any like major side area where i could do that if anyone wants to read the leak that i'm talking about with the whole story you can find it on the assassin's creed subreddit there's a just a post that where someone's got the novel um, and they've got like a picture of it or whatever um uh, and they just write down all the key plot points if you just searched like assassin's creed odyssey novel leak reddit or something i'm sure you'd find it um yeah yeah um, Shield Z, what are the frequencies of new armor loot in comparison to Origins? Was there a large variety of different armor sets? Yeah. I, again, I don't know how consistently that'll be throughout, if that's going to be as consistent from the start to the end of the game, but there was a lot of variety from just the start of the game. But the thing is, you can have the same armor set isn't set to like, well, this is a level four armor piece. They can mm. you can level them up to whatever. So I saw nothing more than like common and rare. Um, so there was enough variety there already. That I was like, well, this is a good variety early on to like change a few arm pieces up, and you know, um, there's a lot more customization options. So there's a lot more than origins. I thought it looks very terms much of like um, like a Shadow of War type uh, gear system to me. Is something I noticed. Yeah, I never yeah. played Shadow of, Shadow of War, so... Honestly, the game I'm reminds not... me a lot of that in a lot of ways, to be honest. They've kind of taken the um, the abilities you get from, like, the Wraith stuff uh, and put it into, like, the Spear. It looks very similar, actually. That's really strange, with, like, the different special abilities you can activate that are, like, on the cross thing. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, yeah, it's a bit weird, actually. And they've got the Nemesis system. I see what they're doing. Mm. Um, I'm trying to find because there's a bunch of questions but most of them I can't answer or like I don't know like so I'm not even going to answer mm. uh, is there a bully in the alley I wish there was but no, I don't think so fortunately there's not um, 